Hey guys, welcome back. So today we're gonna do a little clothing haul. I haven't done one in a while and I wanted to do kind of like an end of summer, starting to transition into fall, like not really, but sort of. So that's what we're doing today. I have a variety of stuff, some dresses, some really casual pieces, some loungewear, some bodysuits, just kind of like everything all over the place because I don't know what you guys are wearing. I don't even really know what I'm wearing these days. Also, really quick before we get into the haul, I wanted to share with you guys one of my new favorite online shopping tools. It's called Shop Tagger, and I am partnering with them for this video, but if you have not downloaded this app yet, you need to because it's amazing. If you're an online shopper, it can save you so much money. So let me show you really quick how it works, and then we will get into the haul. Okay, so the first thing you want to do is download the extension for Google Chrome. That way you can have the little widget up in the corner and it's super easy to use anytime you're shopping. You can just click on it. So here, once it's downloaded, it'll show you just a few of the stores they have. They have so many, like basically any store you would ever want to shop at, they have. So uh, I'll show you guys a really quick little tutorial on how to like save an item and things like that. So um, I'm gonna go to one of the stores that I am featuring in this video, which is Abercrombie. I love their stuff. So let's go to their website and I'm gonna search bodysuits. So one of the bodysuits in this video that you'll see, I'm gonna save really quick. So I'm just gonna click on the item. And then I'm gonna click the shop tagger button up in the corner and save it to a list. So you can make a category of whatever list, let's do tops and save it that way. And then you can be notified when your size is like back in stock or when it goes on sale, 50% off, 25% off, whatever you want. So we saved it to the list. Now I'm gonna add it to our cart so you guys can see if there's any coupons. It does that for you, which is amazing. So over here it says, yay, there's a coupon. So we will check it out and see. And then basically it's gonna tell me that I already have the best price. So sometimes you do, sometimes you don't. So uh, now I will show you guys where you can also find all these other coupons for like whatever store. It'll give you an idea of where all the good sales are happening, all the good coupons. And then they also just added this really cool new feature, which is cash back. So it'll show you how much cash back you can earn on basically any website. They have it broken down by category. This is just women's apparel, but I thought that was really cool. And then they will pay out using PayPal. So it'll show your balance up there, what your cash back is. And yeah, I've really been loving the Shop Tagger app. So if you guys want to sign up and download it, I will have the link in the description box. So first up we have this really cute midi dress from Abercrombie. Uh, I really liked the length of it and the slit. Also the material is a very stretchy, moves with you. It's not like constricting at all. And the color I feel is very neutral. So you could definitely wear this into fall with a sweater or jacket of some sort. But I really like this one and it's super comfy. Even though it's like very form fitting, it doesn't feel like constricting. So then we have another midi dress with a slit. I really just like this length with a slit. It's just, I don't know, it calls my name. It speaks to me. Uh, but anyways, I also really love the print on this. So if you guys know, or if you follow me on Instagram, you know I've been loving pastels. So this has a really nice minty green, a little bit of like blue and purple, but also it has this orange in there. And I feel like the orange makes it wearable into the fall. Again, throw this on with a sweater and it's nice little kind of transitional print. I also love the cut of this. I'm a huge fan of slip dresses and a cowl neckline. I feel like it's just so universally flattering on a lot of different body types and is very forgiving. So if you have any kind of quarantine LBs up in here, a slip dress, I feel like can kind of disguise that a little bit. And these straps on this are adjustable, by the way, which is a must. So next up we have another dress which will transition really nicely into fall. I feel like mainly due to the color. It's this really pretty olive kind of camo green which I love all times of year but fall especially. 
Again, it's a midi length and it has kind of like this ruching detail. This one actually is adjustable. So it has this ruched side. So if you want to make it taller or not taller, <laughs> shorter or longer, uh, you can do that. But I loved the color of this. Again, it's a stretchy material. It's a midi length and I'm obsessed with this. Then we have another floral print dress. This one I love. It's so romantic and pretty and the print is fairly neutral. So even though it's a floral print and there is some color, I like that it's with like this tan beigey background and that the roses are muted. So I love that. And then the bottom has this really pretty flirty, feminine, ruffly high low uh, length, which I love. It's so fun. So if you have any kind of like dinner date or any kind of special occasion that is permitted these days that you have to go to, I feel like this would be really, really cute to wear. This next dress, please forgive me, it's so incredibly wrinkly, but I did not have time to steam it. My order just came in. I wanted to get this video up, so pretend that, that there's no wrinkles <laughs> because it's a very cute dress otherwise. So this has puff sleeves, which I love. It's kind of like a peasant style dress or sleeve, whatever you want to call it, but the material of this is a really nice linen material, so it's not too hot for summer. You definitely transition this into fall as well due to the color, which I I love very neutral but you could definitely dress this up or down with sandals or heels or even like cute little white sneakers would be really adorable kind of giving me like a milkmaid vibe or like i'm hopping on my bicycle to grab a baguette in town i don't know I don't know if you guys are getting that vibe. So then we have this top, which is rather scandalous, and I'm not really sure where I'd wear this other than just to Instagram, but I really loved the color, the sage green. I'm all about it, and I liked the poofy sleeves and the tie front detail, so I'm not really sure where I would wear this, but I do think it's super cute. Of course. <laughs> then we have this little cami bodysuit. It has a swoop cowl neckline and very dainty little spaghetti straps. It's actually a bodysuit. I don't know if I said that, but I really liked this color. It's kind of like this dusty grayish blue and it clearly needs to be steamed, but that is besides the point. Then I have a few bodysuits I wanted to share with you guys. So this first one is from Abercrombie and I love the material of this. It's so lightweight and thin, but it's not sheer. And I love that it's so thin because then it's not bulky when you're tucking it into your jeans or pants, whatever you're tucking it into. Uh, love the neckline. It's like a squared scoop, which I like. Well, not squared, but it's not like a straight up U, you know? you know. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I love this and I also picked it up in one other color. I believe it also comes in black and white, but I of course had to get it in this sage minty green color because it's my obsession. So definitely check these out if you're looking for nice tank bodysuits. So then we have this bodysuit, just like a basic white high neckline. It's almost like racer bag, but not really. I have a few tanks that are like this, but they're all ribbed. So I wanted something that didn't have any ribbing to it. And this one's really nice. It's like a double lined material, so it's not sheer. And I just really like this neckline and cut. I feel like it's really flattering. And then here is that same style bodysuit, but in black. So love it. And if you're wondering, the jeans I'm wearing are from Nasty Gal. They're kind of like this vintage -y mom jean style with like a nice like light blue denim wash. But I really liked the detailing at the foot. So they have like these little slits, which I thought was a fun detail. And if you ever are wearing a cute shoe and you're not barefoot like I am, this would be a nice way to showcase them. Now I'm going to move on to a bunch of like more casual pieces. So I have some graphic tees and also these denim shorts. I really liked the color of these. I know we're like exiting summer, but you can never, it's never too late to find a cute pair of jean shorts, you know? Um, so these are from Abercrombie. They are one of their mom style jeans and it's just like this really nice like faded whitewashed denim. Uh, but anyways, I have a few graphic tees I want to share with you guys. This one says J'adore, and it's from Nasty Gal. I think all three of the graphic tees are from Nasty Gal. They always have really cute stuff there. Some of them say weird things and are inappropriate, but they do have some good stuff. So this one comes cropped already, which is nice. I might crop it a little bit more, but I really liked the, you know, just simple print and the color. 
Then we have this one that just says 1986 Beverly Hills. And this one is not cropped. It's like a full length. So if you wanted to wear it as like a longer tee, you definitely could. But I kind of just wear mine like up here. And then the last one just says a lazy girls club, which I feel like we're all a part of these days. And yeah, I just really liked the bright, like light lime green color. Um, and that brings me to one of my favorite purchases, which is these sweat shorts. They are seriously, I kid you not, the softest material in the whole entire world. And I'm obsessed. If they have more colors, I'm buying more colors because I want to just be buried in these they are so incredibly soft you need them they are from american eagle and they're not like a fashion statement but they are a comfort statement and i swear if you buy these you will love them so cannot go wrong with sweat shorts am i right then i know this gray does not match this gray there's a lot of grays going on 50 shades of gray only it's not a seductive situation it's a sweat suit situation but i'm into it and yeah it's kind of like this crop sweatshirt but it's not really a sweatshirt just kind of like a knit material but it's cropped oversized and comfortable so this is what i'm just going to be wearing realistically but if you're interested in any of the other cute pieces that's cool too but this is what i want to be wearing at all times so again, if they have more colors of this, I'm ordering them. Then I would like to show you guys what I'm calling my fancy pants. They are like a fancy sweatpant and I'm all about that. They are socially acceptable sweatpants. They have this really cute ruffly waistband, which is so adorable. They come in a few colors, but I got this blush shade. I think I would definitely get more shades of this as well. And yeah, they're like a jogger, but fancier. And I'm very into them. That is going to wrap up today's clothing haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know in the comments what your favorite piece was. If you plan on picking anything up, let me know. Also, don't forget to check out and download the Shop Tagger app. It is amazing. I will have everything linked on how to sign up in the description box. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys next time.